If you're a budding business intelligence or data analyst, you're always on the lookout for free tools and resources to help you learn, upskill and practice. Well, when it comes to SQL, there's a new tool that's just become available that you're really going to want to know about. Let's take a look. Hello and welcome to Learn BI Online with me, Adam Finer, helping you do more with data. And in this case, I'm definitely staying true to my word because there's a new tool that is seriously going to help you up your SQL game, saving you time and money. Money because it's free and time because, well, you'll understand why in a minute. So what is this new tool? Well, actually, it's a new version of an existing tool, my favourite tool for SQL, in fact, that I've been using for almost 15 years. That tool is called Navicat Premium, and this tool is called Navicat Premium Lite, which, as the name suggests, is a stripped-down version of the full application. Full disclosure, Navicat are sponsoring today's video, so a huge thank you to them for their support. So we'll discover exactly which functionalities you get in the light version in a minute. But first, what makes this tool different from a lot of other tools out there? Well, while other free tools like MySQL Workbench, SQL Server Management Studio and PG Admin for PostgreSQL are all good tools, they only allow you to connect to a single RDBMS. As a BI analyst or consultant, you can find yourself working with different RDBMS for different jobs. So you could end up working with multiple tools, which can be hard to manage and also means you need to learn multiple tools. Navicat Premium, on the other hand, allows you to connect to and manage loads of different RDBMS from one single application, meaning you can have all of your projects and jobs in one place and you only need to learn to use a single tool to manage them. Let's have a look at what exactly you can connect to. Here is the full list and you can see that it's pretty extensive. And what's great is that you get all of these connectors with both Navicat Premium and Premium Lite. We've got standard connectors to all of the most common RDBMS. MySQL, Postgres, SQL Server, Oracle, SQLite, MariaDB, as well as NoSQL databases, Redis and MongoDB. Then you also have different versions of these same sources from various vendors. Amazon, Microsoft, Google, Oracle, among others. So a really comprehensive list. The tool itself has a fantastic intuitive interface and the full version is packed full of all the features you'd need to create and administer databases. But because we're talking about the light version, let's focus first on the functionalities you get with that rather than the ones that you don't. Starting off with the object designer. I can create new databases. In each database, I can create new tables or look at the design of existing tables to perhaps modify their properties, add new fields, delete existing ones or change the field order. You also get import and export functionality. So you can import from text, CSV, JSON and XML files. You can see the other options greyed out because those are only available with the full version. In fact, everywhere you see this orange ENT badge means that you need to upgrade to access that functionality. In terms of export, you get a couple more options in HTML and SQL script files. The import and export wizards make everything very simple and they are incredibly fast. For example, when you compare importing data with MySQL Workbench, it's like comparing a Ferrari with a bicycle. Next, we have the data viewer that allows you to not only see the data within tables, apply filters, etc., but you can also edit data directly in the table without needing to write any SQL. So here I could clean these values by applying a filter, selecting all of the cells, and then simply entering the correct value. Next up, we also have Navicat's Query Editor, which has great features like code completion. So when I type, I get suggestions for objects and fields that I can simply add by hitting tab or return. What this does is essentially make sure there are no typos, which would stop my code from running, which saves me time. Another function that saves time is code snippets, which you can add to the Query Editor just by double-clicking them from here. You can also add your own. 
One thing I kind of thought might be included with the light version is the Beautify SQL option. For people like me who learn SQL by themselves on the job, I was never taught correct formatting of queries. Some SQL professionals sometimes look at my code and they're not impressed. Having this beautify SQL option makes it at least look like I know how to format my SQL. It's available in other free tools, so I was a bit surprised to not find it included. In fact, I reached out to Navicat with this opinion and guess what? They say they're going to include it in an upcoming version of Premium Lite. So thanks in advance to the developers at Navicat. So those are the main features you get with Navicat Premium Lite in terms of working with your SQL databases. You can also use it with Navicat Cloud so that you can collaborate with others by sharing objects, queries, code snippets, etc. Overall, you get quite a lot for a free tool. Although its main selling point is that it connects to loads of different SQL and NoSQL databases. It's also cross-platform, so it works with Mac, Windows, and Linux. Here are all of the system requirements for each. Honestly, if you're going to be learning SQL, this is the tool you need. As a free tool that connects to pretty much everything, it's a no-brainer. Up until now, I've always recommended to my students that they download the free trial version of Navicat Premium. So now I won't have to. Now they can just download the light version and keep it for as long as they want. But what do you get if you do upgrade to the full version? Well, there's a feature matrix available on the website that allows you to compare versions. So I'll leave a link to that in the description. But basically, as we saw, everything that has the ENT badge on it. So you get the backup, automation, modeling, and data visualization tools, as well as a few other smaller things like the graphical query builder. You can still get a free trial of the full version, so you can compare and contrast if you like. Thanks so much to Navicat for sponsoring today's video. To download and get started, just click the link in the description. To learn basic SQL in 15 minutes, watch this video. And if you want to study to become a business intelligence analyst, just click here. See you soon for another video. Until then, bye.